Hi everyone, welcome to this playthrough of Super Mario Brothers Wonder. It released just today for me, but <sighs> some people got the game early, so I don't feel too like I didn't feel pressure to play this game as soon as it released on midnight because of all the spoilers and uh, people who got the game early and whatnot. But uh, I will be doing a playthrough of it to show my reactions to it. I did not get spoiled about most things. All I know is that there's like like some of the bosses, but I don't know how they fight, but uh, just like how they look. And uh, I also know there's like some kind of music level in, in the game, like music levels, I should say. But for the most part, I'm not spoiled, so uh, don't worry about me uh, knowing everything about everything. Oh, you can pick random. Oh, okay, but I should explain, actually. Yoshi, Red Yoshi, Yellow Yoshi, Light Blue Yoshi, and Nabbit do not take damage, but they also won't transform with power-ups, while all these goobers, they're quote-unquote normal. But you know what? I want to go random! I don't even care if I get an invincible character. I actually uh, kind of want to go random. And we got Peach! Peachy's got it! I was actually kind of hoping for a red Yoshi, but uh, it's probably best that I actually play as a, a normal character to show all the transformations and whatnot. Anyway, welcome to the Flower Kingdom. It's just a short hop away from the Mushroom Kingdom. Upon receiving an invitation from Prince Florian, Peach and the others are traveling here for the first time. Okay, let's uh, test the controls. Peach cannot float. The, all the characters that play the same way as they do uh, as Mario does, basically. Okay, big jump? No, I can't. I can't look up. I can spin jump, I can also spin, so... Quote unquote, new Super Mario Brothers types controls for the most part. Where is the party? Oh, there's Mario and Luigi. I can't wave. What the? Oh. Well, I can't. I can put emoticons, but uh, not. Uh, not uh, other things. Oh, no, yeah. Petria would be here, I bet. Uh, don't know about Daisy, though. <laughs> also, Nabbit was back there. Yeah, apparently Daisy's the only one who uh, didn't appear here. Weird. Maybe she's not supposed to be here at all. Either that or she was supposed to be with Peach, but because I'm playing as Peach, uh, she didn't spawn. Yeah, there she is. As well as Toadette. And the Toads. I think the Toads were here before, though. And I guess that's P Prince Florian. And there's Kamek up there. We really need more air defense, don't we? And then it was just Bowser just uh, coming in real quick. And making a big show of himself. There was Junior's there too. Wow, so literally... Well, I guess Mario tried to stop Bowser. So did Peach. She's kind of reaching. And Daisy too, but she's way too far. <laughs> Luigi just this guy looks like he's spooked. Anyway, apparently the, the Wonder Flower gives you uh, Zawardo powers to all your enemies, but not your allies. And also Bowser is now a, just, literally just straight up a castle. A uh, Koopa Clown Car castle, I guess. And that's the plot. To be fair, they're, they're quite minimalistic on dialogue, which is honestly very uh, fitting for uh, the Mario franchise. It has always been a, a franchise that has been extremely limited on dialogue. Not in the sense that they're, they can't have dialogue, it's just in the sense that uh, it makes more sense for it to just put you straight into the action and let you feel the game. Uh, and I say that when the game just introduces dialogue right here. <laughs> Oh, he, mer he merged with the flower castle. Well, your guests will take care of it. Specifically Peach. Mario, Luigi, the Toads, and Daisy will just sit back and do nothing. Don't know about the Yoshis, though. Yoshis, you can ride them. And Nabbit, I kind of doubt he'll appear at all. <laughs> Kind 
I need to raise the sound. I can hear. Oh, there they, there they are. I guess they're coming. I believe in you. I believe in you. Oh, uh, something else. Uh, well, for one, Mario has uh, changed the uh, voice actor. That's a uh, pretty common knowledge. Yeah. Apparently, so did Daisy, though. I don't know if the other characters also did. People keep changing. They did a, like a major switch up with all the character voices, but I do not know if they actually did a change for the others. Okay, pipe rock. So. Wait, standees? Okay. We're probably gonna see a lot of these. <laughs> and of course the badges are for the special abilities, which probably like, I assume for like playing as Peach, we're gonna have like a floating ability we can equip to her to make her feel like she's playing Super Mario Brothers 2 style. Anyway, welcome to the Flower Kingdom. I think we're, we're gonna try to do at least one world per video or one half of a world per video. I, I kinda have to estimate about it. Onward and upward. Okay. Coins. What are coins for? They're also purple coins. Can ground bound. Oh, I can... Hold up. I can move a bit after doing my ground bound. What a beautiful day! Have a good breeze. Okay, interesting. Ow! I did not mean to... I did not mean to die to the first Goomba. I didn't actually die to the first Goomba, but uh, didn't mean to get hit by the first Goomba. I was curious to see if uh, if uh, I like uh, if I touched it, it would actually uh, die, right? But it didn't. There we go. Oh, we can crawl a bit. So yeah, this, this game's controls are mostly an expansion on the new Super Mario Bros. formula. Yes, that Goombo was quite serene, but now it's dead. And now I'm Elephant. What is this? Hold up. Uh, does this flower not do anything? Oh! Okay, I thought holding up would actually do something there, but it didn't. Oh, okay, I see. So that was, that's what I was supposed to do. I was supposed to water it. Well, I'm not gonna be able to water that plant now. Or, no, I can't do it by doing this. And there's lots to do with all the controls. What about this? This looks suspicious. Plane of ground right here. Hey. Hi. Hi. Can I get a backup? Backups have existed since, uh, well, not technically Super Mario Bros. 3, those were items back then, but uh, Super Mario World kind of implemented it as proper. Uh, backups during the stages. It's time to go crazy! What happens if I go back? Not much. Oh, I want that. Well, a lot of the stuff uh, we found uh, of the game was basically in the intro. I'm curious if I'm on a time limit right now, by the way. Got a wonder seed. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know if I was on a time limit. If I was, well, getting the wonder, the extra wonder seed is gonna, it's gonna be a challenge. Of course, it wasn't much of a challenge for level one here, but it might be later on if I am timed. Well, yeah, completing the level gives you another Wonder Seed. So there's one secret Wonder Seed for each stage, but you also get a free Wonder Seed for beating it. I wonder when we'll get online functionality. I imagine there will be. What about coins and purple coins, though? I don't know what they do. Hmm. Also, we have lives as well. Uh, lives uh, probably work the way they 
usually do nowadays, in that uh, if you lose one, you go back to your checkpoint, you lose them all, you have to start the stage over. Used to be that you had to start the entire game over. But checkpoints have existed since Super, since Super Mario Bros. 1. The original. It's actually kind of curious to how punishing the games are. You know, I do not know what I'm going to do for this stage here. I guess I'm going to go down this pipe. Oh, I'm in the background! <laughs> I thought it was going to switch to, um, to something else. The game probably would have told me that I'm in the background eventually, though. Hopefully I don't need to collect every single coin. Ten, okay, the ten coins, there's three per stage. I probably want to keep uh, the elephant in case I need it for later. So you can get over there. Yes, I can. Okay. Walking plants, huh? Almost as weird as talking plants. Yeah. Walking plants, almost as weird as talking plants. Okay. Wow, the, the the controller is making like is emitting sounds uh, while I'm uh, doing stuff, and there doesn't seem to be anything up there. By the way, that thing was going away, so I had to rush to get it. Uh, we're on an auto scroller now. Yes, they are singing. Piranha plants on parade. Oh my God! So okay. People were suspecting that uh, there was an Elephants on Parade reference here, which is a Disney uh, reference of an old uh, cartoon they used to do. This is pretty much a confirmation of it. <laughs> because people saw the drug uh, connotations about uh, the Wonder Seed, and here the game is basically spelling it out to, yes, that's what we're referencing. And we can still get damage even after using the Wonder Seed. That's good confirmation right there. You don't see that every day. Got the Wonder Seed. Unfortunately, I couldn't listen to that very well because um, I have my headset on. And the game's sound isn't being emitted through my headset. It's just uh, kind of covering my ears. Very annoying. I could look into making these things uh, connected. By the way, I'd, I hope I didn't have to get on top of the flagpole for the best reward. <laughs> It's also possible I missed something else. Did I get all three purple coins? Actually, hmm. the game doesn't care if you get three purple coins or not. It just, like, they exist, but you don't need to get them. Cool! I actually really like that. Because I kind of, like, I get that there's a repeat replayability involved with the uh, big coins they introduced in the first new Super Mario Brothers on the DS. But uh, I always felt they were like an, an annoying collectible to get. Because they could hide it in places that are just... Uh, like they require you to backtrack or look around everywhere and just feels kind of uh, lame. While the Wonder Seed is kind of like part of the stage and you kind of can't miss it. At least for now. Could be just talking too early. Still no badges unlocked. Hmm. Let's check uh, other controls settings. Interesting, you can make it so that it's only when you press uh, down, uh, when you press ZL in midair instead of uh, both ZL and down on the control stick. And some people prefer uh, A to jump and B to dash as opposed to Y to dash and B to jump. People who grew up on the Game Boy, I find, prefer this. Or if they grew up on the NES. But I grew up on the Super Nintendo, so this is what I want. Uh, motion controls, rumble, they're strong. You can also turn off sound if you want. L lots of controls. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, if you find uh, voices annoying for these guys, well, we can do this, but... Uh... Oh, my. You know what? I'm making them French. <laughs> I'll understand, and I'll translate the best I can. I'll also spice up uh, our uh, playthrough. 
It's also interesting that you can only change, like you can just make it so specifically you change only the flowers dialogue. Ha! Okay, this is an interesting enemy. He keeps running away from you. No matter what. Can I go here? No, I can't. Ah! Give me. Ah, I would have gotten another one right here. Water. Hey, that's mine. Ah! Uh, I wonder if there's some secrets and dirty things. Oh, there's coins. There is something down here. Got a purple coin. Oh, you need your help. And they're so scared, <laughs> these enemies. They're kind of cute, but I also kind of want to destroy them. Oh, I screwed that up. Oh, okay, the, the text does not uh, change language, but the way, the, the, the things they say is in uh, uh, French Canadian. That's kind of lame, I was kind of hoping their text would change to um, French Canadian, but uh, if I, it's all it's gonna do is uh, change the voice like that, I'm just gonna leave it in English. Because I can't really hear it. <laughs> I was hoping to, them to change it. Can't drop to the platforms. Now, what is this gonna do? Oh god, only 10 seconds. Fall. Okay, I did get time refills for getting the stars, I think? I, I couldn't quite tell. It's probably more obvious when you look back at the footage, but... Uh, I also missed uh, some purple uh, pieces, but uh, whatever. Level is over. Skedaddlers, that's what they're named. And what is this? Uh, just a cutscene thing? Oh, isn't this fun? The Flower Castle is me, and I'm the Flower Castle. So much wonder power! I can feel myself getting stronger, and stronger, and stronger! Soon everything will be mine! <laughs> it? That's no good Bowser castle. I won't stand for his antics. We've got to get to him somehow. Let's use that propeller flower up ahead to catch up. But that's how we change levels? Or worlds, I guess you should say? 